The city of Fontana held a press conference and welcomed Representative Pete Aguilar, who joined city officials to announce upcoming plans for the Homeless Prevention Resource and Care Center. The project is being funded with $8 million from the American Rescue Plan Act and with $4 million from the government funding package approved by Congress in December. And so this is something that will move very quick because of the leadership that Fontana has uh, put forward. They've made this a priority. Fontana Deputy City Manager Phil Burham said the center will provide job placement and 24-hour wraparound services and will include three separate neighborhoods. Phase one of our new homeless resource care facility will include will be an immediate resource for 48 individuals to be housed. San Bernardino County 2nd District Supervisor Jesse Armaderas said programs provided by the center will not have a one-size-fits-all approach. But it is a, a project that will unite everyone, our mental health, our drug addicted, our homeless, our seniors. Those who are most impacted are the ones who we are here to help today. Council Member Sandoval, whose district will be the location for the center, thanked Representative Aguilar and U.S. Senator Alex Padilla for getting the funding through Congress. You know, uh, the one thing about it is that we all say that the federal government doesn't care, but they do care. Calling it a one-of-a-kind facility, Mayor Warren went on to address the importance of not only housing individuals that need it, but also providing support and prevention. That this council is committed to ending homelessness in Fontana, and we're not afraid to say that. For KFON TV, this is Francisco Vega.